This is home link 1010, locating points on a map. In an ordered pair, such as 3-6, the first number indicates how far the point is to the right or left of 0. The second number indicates how far it is above or below 0. So we have a map here, and there's a coordinate grid behind it from the number, with the numbers 0 to 7. Here is a map of Africa. Write the name of each country in which, write the name of the country in which each point is located. So if we find 3, 6, we go across 3, so we're going across first, across 3, and up 6, and the point is right here, that's 3, 6, you can even label it, and it's in Algeria, and that's what you write down, the name of the country where it is, so you have to look at the borders that that point falls in. Number 2, 6, 3, so for 6, 3, we go across 6 first, and then up 3, and it's right here, 6. Three, and that's in Tanzania. Tanzania. And we studied Africa this year, so um, you might recognize some of these countries. Next point is 5, 5. Go across 5, and then up 5 right here. Okay, this one is in Sudan. And that's what we're right here. Sudan. And then the next one, number 4, is 4, 5. Go across 4, and then up 5. And this one is, I'm going to label it again, 4, 5, and that's in Chad. Okay, the name of the country, Chad. The next one, number 5, is 5, 6, so across 5 and up 6. Right here. Oh, whoops, I mislabeled it. I, mis I mis made a mistake. So that's going to be 5, 6. And this one's in Egypt. Okay, 5, 6 is right here in Egypt. Egypt. All right, and then the last one. Number 6 is 4, 6. You go over 4, up 6, so 4, 6. And that's why it's a good idea to label it, because if you do make a mistake, you can see where you went wrong. Okay, so 4, 6 is in Libya. <coughs> L-I-B-Y-A. Okay, so this is locating points on a map. Home link 10, 10 for grade 3 everyday math. Okay, that was